Welcome my peeps, my peoples. Peep Squad is in the building, baby. So let's get into it. Let's talk about growing up hip hop. Even though Romeo is not a part of the cast no more, but it seems like Romeo has jumped off the porch to let us know that he has a new relationship that might be blooming and blossoming. I was like, go ahead, Romeo. Romeo ain't playing no games. He has been very stingy with his seed. He is not trying to populate the universe by any means. He is taking his time and make sure he get the right woman that he can spend the rest of his life with because he don't want to play around. He want a wife and a carriage, baby. He want a wife and a baby. And he also said he want a baby by 2020. So it is what it is. And Romeo don't play no games because he knows that when he has a kid with somebody, he is attached to them for life. And he ain't playing around. And he is serious about who he picks and who he dates. And it seems like... Mm, Drew Sangster is the new one. She seems like she might be staying around and she has got Romeo's attention where he is coming down there to see her and spend Thanksgiving with her family. I was like, go ahead, Romeo. Romeo's trying to make this legit and official. We're going to see what happens with this situation. But let's get into it with Romeo talking about he want to have a baby by 2021. And let's not forget Brianna Latrice. She has a new relationship that is blossoming and blooming too as well. And we have Angela Simmons, where she is really happy with Daniel Jacob. She is loving that relationship, and they are keeping it cute, keeping it tight, and keeping it secret. So we will see if we will see Brianna Latrice and Angela Simmons, new men on the show. Mm -mm -mm. But let's check out Romeo first and see what he got to say, baby. I was like, mm, Romeo. The next year. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh really? Next year, baby. Ah! Said, what? <laughs> Happy Father's Day. I believe I'm gonna be a father next year. Look at this. Oh, oh, really? Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. I believe I'm gonna be a father next year. Look at this. Oh, oh, really? Mm, mm, mm. Romeo, Romeo. You know he could be joking, but. And every joke, there is some truth to it. And Romeo will be a great father and a great husband. Let's get let's get to it, baby. I was like, go ahead, Romeo. And Romeo posted to his Instagram to let us know. He said, I'm thankful. I accepted the Thanksgiving invite. He is grateful that he accepted that Thanksgiving invite because, baby, I bet you he had a good time. He had a great time. Because if he didn't, he wouldn't have posted to Instagram and post up his new boo thing something is blooming and blossoming too and she's a beautiful young lady too as well he said i could get used to this yes he could get used to a home cooked meal a beautiful woman in the house and a baby you know romeo is ready drew sangster he said yesterday was a good day cuffing season he was like yes it was a good day you already know romeo is serious he don't jump off the porch like this and talk about anything that is really personal in his life and his personal life so romeo is feeling this young lady go drew thanks the girl you don't got them you don't got a good one you bet not let it go and when you go to drew sangster's instagram it is private she only have kiki and romeo miller following her that are celebrities so i think she runs in the circle she is in the circle romeo done got him a bad one hopefully it works and she answered his posts and she answered his bible quotes and scripture and she responds and hopefully she is full sanctified and filled with the lord because romeo is a christian man he wants a christian woman baby you know how Romeo is. His reputation is everything. And he won't let anybody destroy his reputation or make him look bad or make him look like the person that he is not. Because Romeo will get out here and put them scriptures on you in a quick, fast, in a heartbeat. Go ahead, Romeo. Do your thing. Mm -mm -mm. Congratulations. I hope your dreams come true as well as mine and everybody that's viewing this video. So let's get into Brianna Latrice. Le Brianna Latrice got a new man. His name is Bobby. Bobby and Brianna Latrice has been dating for at least two to three months. I believe they have been knowing each other for a long time. But, you know, they argue a lot. It seems like when they're on Instagram, they're arguing. It seems like Bobby is very sensitive. And Brianna is not a vulnerable person. She's not a vulnerable woman. Like, she has her gourds up. And sometimes she can come off very dominant and very controlling. And she wants things her way and her way only and she's not going to put up with the disrespect but also brianna treese 
has been up and down and around the world. So you can't run any game with her. You can't play any sucker ish with her. She knows the game. She knows what's going on. And she'll let you fly for a little bit. But when she gets ready to pull your cord, she's going to pull your cord. Whether she's on Instagram Live or in front of your face. Bobby and Brianna Latrice, they have been visiting each other. Brianna Latrice recently went to go see him, and she spent some days with him throughout the pandemic. They were partying, having a good time. She met his family. I believe she visited him twice throughout the pandemic, and she had a good time, but they did have a little bit of argument, especially when Bobby went to Dior, and he brought back Brianna Latrice a shitty gift. And she was like, "What? why would you do that? Why would you buy me something out the airport like that? You put no thought in it. And he was trying to say he did. When Brianna Latrice said that she went to his home to visit him and his family and she brought each and every one of his, his mother, his brother, and maybe his sister gifts. And she really put some thought into their gift and he put no thought in her gift. And she was feeling a certain type of way and she cussed his ass out on instagram but it seems like they have made up but i haven't seen bobby and any recent you know instagram live videos that brianna latrice posts on instagram so but they are still in a relationship they are still going together i don't know if brianna latrice is going to put bobby on growing up hip-hop i don't know if that will be a good situation because i don't think he can be able to handle you know the scrutiny the backlash or maybe the being popular i don't know if he'll be able to hold handle that because he's, he's very sensitive and things get under his skin he might not be able to handle the fame like brianna is able to handle the fame of growing up hip-hop she's been up and down inside and out when it comes to growing up hip-hop and now she has clawed her way to the top and she is a fan favorite on growing up hip-hop so whatever dude standing next to her has to be strong and has to stand 10 toes down. I believe Bobby do have children, but I'm not positive. And I believe he has his own business. I believe he's a caterer. He has his own catering service. And he's an entrepreneur. And he's a smart man. And he has a beautiful home too. And a good personality. They may work out or they may not. But sometimes when you are in love, or you're very fond of the person, sometimes, you know, any little thing they do and say sometimes can hurt you because you just want them to think of you as being the best and just being good all the time. And sometimes they don't pan out that way and people feelings get hurt. But Bobby got to understand she's not a vulnerable woman. She don't play no games and she wants to be treated with respect all day and every day. And also, Brianna got to chill on how she talks to the man, you know, because sometimes a man can feel emasculated by some of the words that you use that can cut him deep. So we'll see what transpired between Bobby and Brianna Latrice. Let's see if he will be up on growing up hip hop. Mm, mm, mm. You guys tell me what you think about that situation. Lord, help us all. And let's get into it with Angela Simmons. Angela Simmons is doing the damn thing. It seems like she is still happy. And she's going strong with Daniel Jacobs. They have been going to the park together. They've been having picnics together. They have been playing golf together. And also, Angela's son is with them too. And it's like, you know, Daniel Jacobs and... Angela Simmons son have a good relationship. They hang out together. He comes to her crib. You know, he brings um, a chef. He brings music. He be he's spoiling. He is spoiling for real, for real. Angela Simmons. He's treating her like she wants to be treated and she ain't playing around. Look at this photo. She's she's smelling him. She's sucking up him because She's in love, baby. Angela Simmons ain't playing around. And she got she got a boxer that makes that money. That's number one. And number two, he worships her. And he is not trying to seek attention in the public. He's not trying to be on Instagram Live. He's not trying to be on Instagram, Twitter. He's not trying to be on TikTok. He is holding it down. He keeps his business private. And you know Angela loves a man that is private because... When she was with Sutton, she made sure that she didn't bring up that information or her dating history or her dating past with Sutton on the show. She kept that on the DL. She was not playing around with her situation. And it seems like 
Daniel Jacobs is a perfect fit for Angela Simmons because he likes to lay in the cut and he will let Angela get her shine. And Angela is used to somebody with fame and fortune because she has fame and fortune too. So it's all good. I was like, go ahead, Angela, do your thing. Angela ain't playing around. Angela is happy. When she posts to Instagram, you got to see the love in her post. You got to see the happiness in her post. She's getting over the drama. This is a beautiful dinner that Daniel Jacobs, you know, provided Angela Simmons with at her house throughout the pandemic. He came through with a jazz musician and he had dinner for his woman and also... And between time, Daniel Jacobs' ex and his children's mother, she tried to come up in a situation and call out Angela and call out Daniel Jacobs and basically say Daniel is wrong. He did her in because when he was sick and he was ill, she was there lifting him up, putting energy in his body, making sure he was okay and making sure their children was okay. But he has moved on. He is with Angela now. And it seems like that situation that popped off in the media in the beginning when Angela Angela announced that she was dating or let us know that she was rocking with Jacob. She didn't let that hiccup get in between her relationship. She just kept it moving and kept it going. She didn't even acknowledge the situation. She just kept it 100 and she stayed with her man and they post to Instagram together and then he keeps it moving and she keeps it moving. But it would be interesting to see if Daniel Jacobs actually comes on growing up hip hop LA because as we know they are filming the little twist let us know that they are filming and also Brianna Latrice let us know that they are filming too you know Angela she's one of the execs over there she is one of the she is one of you know the producers over there so she's just keeping her mouth closed yeah, her mouth is closed, but is happy with Jacob. So you guys let me know what you think about this situation. I was like, it is going down. Angela has left the past behind. She has moved on from Bow Weezy, Bow Wow, Shad Moss, and Little Romeo and Romeo Miller. She has moved forward, and it seems like Romeo has moved forward too, and he's ready to have that happy family, and Bow is still up in the air whether he will ever settle down. As long as there is strip club, Bow Wow will be in the strip club and with different women every night. But Romeo ain't trying to have kids out here like Bow or Future. For real, for real. He ain't trying to find out that he got a baby somewhere and he finds out on Instagram. That is not how Romeo Miller is moving at all. He wants the sanctity of marriage. Mm, mm, mm. And he don't want no baby out of wedlock, baby.